welcome in my new video and today we're gonna do a makeup tutorial about my daily makeup in the shop so what do you need for this tutorial First, we're gonna do some foundation on a little sponge and put it on my face. Just a little bit everywhere, like that you have some spots. So with this brush, you just um, equalize the foundation over your face. That's every piece of skin is covered with a little bit foundation then you have some powder to make it matte again now the foundation is ready now you're gonna make a little bit of shape with this one and you can use this brush for it shaping shaping you can just do it like here When it's a bit too much, you can just roll it out. And here. It looks like much, but on stage it's not much. It's actually perfect because, of course, the people in the back, back, background ones also see that you have some shape in your face. <laughs> okay, next eyebrows so I use this one with a little bit of um, hairspray and I will put it in my eyebrows because I have big eyebrows and when I don't do it like this they're gonna go er in every direction first put it up and then put it into shape and then it will for sure stay like this then you have a little eyebrow pencil the little one and the dark brown and if you have light brown eyebrows or red eyebrows or blonde you can better put another color otherwise it will be a little bit weird I'm just putting it in the piece in the places where it, where it can be a little bit more So, shaping eyebrows, great. Then we're gonna start with the eyes. The eyes is with the white one and another brush, a special white brush. I'm gonna first put it under the eyebrow and also the other side. I use a white a lot, that's why it's almost empty. So you can really do bring it thick there, like really, really white because we're gonna blend it out later and we're gonna do it also on the eyelid then we're gonna use the blend brush this one with the light brown eyeshadow and we're gonna put it in between the white so it's starting here from out the corner of your eye then go a little bit up and go then like this the darkest point can be in the corner and just this is already enough because it's just light brown and over this we're gonna put some purple on the other way also So then we're gonna with the same brush you have to just clean it a little bit I do it on the towel we're gonna use the purple uh, with the blend brush 
We're gonna start in the corner, exactly the same idea. This is gonna be a little bit heavy. So that's why you have to be a little bit more careful than the brown, light brown one. The corner has to be the most dark. Now it's already there. We'll put it also on the other side. Clean it in between, because otherwise it's gonna be dark, 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 dark. Because then you can already a little bit starting to blend, like this. It's already in a good way, like this is not so blendy and now we're gonna blend it with the same brush but a little bit more cleaner. Nice, and now for the touch I just want the darkest point is really in the corner, so I just put some extra here in the corner. Now with a little brush, a little bit more um, detail brush, I'm gonna put it also under my eye. And then mix it up a little bit with this one, that it's really... That's a really nice over that really fits good with each other. But then we're already at the eyeliner point. This is the eyeliner that I use from MAC, and this is the brush. It's like with only a few hairs here. So I'm gonna just do it like this. I always use for the eyeliner a little mirror with the mirror. First under the eye, I start from the from a little bit from the end and goes to and goes a little bit further than the eye, then it will be a little bit an Arabic feel. Then from up here you go you do like make a little wing from it. And go over the eye to the corner and as the thinnest point should be in the corner. Then one, one eye eyeliner done. So, then fake lashes. So I have every time actually different ones. I just get them from Muscat. For example, now I'm gonna use this uh, brand, Paris Berlin. Or sometimes I also use Cry Cryolan, this one, they're really good and I can do like several shows with them, so that's amazing. And this is amazing glue duo, this glue is holds the whole show, I never have to worry about my lashes, so that's amazing. This is one of the lashes, I'm gonna put some glue on it and then let it dry for 15 seconds or something. because then it sticks better. And also with my lashes, always like the smaller side should be the inside and the longer side should be out the outside. I always use a little mirror because then I can really be really close. If, it, if it's on, you see, then it should dry. You can do the other one. Now it has time to dry. When it dried, like half a minute, maybe a minute, then you can use your mascara to put them together and to make them more volume in it. Try to uh, put the mascara only on your own uh, lashes and maybe a little bit on the other lashes because otherwise it's gonna be really sticky and you don't want that after the show that you take off your lashes and your own lashes come with it. Minutes is over, so for sure can do a little bit like this to make it extra dry. Up, of course, but under you can also do a little bit, just a touch that it's that it's good matching. I have really long under lashes, so when I put too much in there, it's almost like the same as up. So I will just touch it a little bit like this. Now, then we're almost ready. Just to give 
some more life on this face. <laughs> we can use some rouge. Just smile and put it on the top of your cheeks. A little bit, not too much, otherwise it's gonna be a little bit dull like. So, ready! Makeup is on. Let's see if I can show you with daylight. And that's how you do it, and I do it every day, so with me it goes really fast. I can do it now, I think, in. Give me seven minutes and the makeup is on. I hope you like this tutorial. I'm really not a, a makeup specialist. The only thing I can do good is this look. And I'm really proud of it. And yes, I feel really good in it. I hope you can try it at home too. And then also feel a little bit like a princess. I just went to the mosque. I had to go and I had to stop filming. But I almost forget. Of course, lipstick. It's this one from MAC and I'm gonna put it after I brush my teeth. I hope you enjoyed the video. I really enjoyed it making and uh, I wish you all a really good, good day. Bye guys!